Tennessee. You hear a metal Tennessee? Geographical center of something that's that. Leave a comment. Shot the dog sign. Thanks everybody left a comment. I guess you could say this episode 
are brought to you by the flywheel department. Uh, we get a couple more coats of paint on them. That's that charcoal gray right there. Uh, two coats on one of them are one coat on the other one. And we'll get about three coats on there with a brush. Oil base enamel. Spray job on that red one up there. Bare metal in the background. Brush the metal primer. Oh, yeah. I had a couple of new pivot pins. Cross drilled. Cotters. Waiting on a paint dry. Ah, little Nelson brothers there. Tag on it there is going to be, uh, it's going to be badged at one of them Mac Lloyds. You know, one of them sold up there in Canada. So, now these has a serial number on the flywheel right there. Goes to the engine. Yeah, we'll get them flywheels on there tomorrow. Yeah, one and one and three quarters one and three quarters horsepower. Nelson Brothers. With a McLeod brass tack. Webster Magneto. And we'll rig up a gas tank there tomorrow. Get another coat of paint on it. Well, I got that engine right there. Yeah, that head, somebody had. They'd cut some seats in it, but they never did lap the valves. They, they were used valves. I cleaned them up. Seemed to fit pretty good. So I done left them in there really good. Put them back together. Well, it's got the used rings in it. Came with it. Babbitt Pirates. Nelson Brothers. One and three quarters horsepower. Rust oleum and charcoal gray. In the meantime, I'm gonna go ahead and uh, uh, knock out this run of uh, them axle center part right there. Oh, it's half inch drill right there. Drill two holes each end for plug welding. You know, press your axle inside that, plug weld it. And, and then an upcoming uh, story, uh, finish up. This engine right here, if you remember, uh, some videos back on the on the channel here, that this that Munion engine right here, it's that engine that came from an auction sale where the William Munion had a little tractor, a big tractor, full size, up on a silo, and it done fell down. Okay, it, it's, this engine came from his sale. So, it, you know, it's got some history to it. Full rebuild. Uh, parts and stuff, you know, run up around. I'm going to get the paperwork out, sat down. Now, we're going to talk about how much it costs to build one of these engines. Uh, the, this engine right here was, uh, it was sold up there in Canada. It's got a Canada number plate on it right there. That yeah, full rebuild. Um, just ain't never been started. A uh, new oiler. Ain't never had, uh, that oiler ain't never had oil in it. Mm, just saying.